Sometimes they're good and sometimes they're bad. What? Margaritas. Oh. They're mostly good. They're mostly good, except I have to tell you that no matter how upset I get with everyone who comes in here and has like a really bougie coffee order and things like that, you know, and I make fun of them. Uh huh. I can't. The margaritas that are made with like the crappy margarita mix. Yeah. It's just not good. And it's hangover central. It's got tons of sugar in it. And I can't do it. So I. You're about to be really bougie, aren't you? I do prefer it with fresh squeezed lime juice. That's all I got. It's the Brett Davern Show. It sure is. <laughs> Brought to you by Adobe Radio. In partnership with Nice Guy Digital. And recorded live in beautiful North Hollywood, California. On today's episode, I tell you the best thing I've seen all weekend. And in studio, we have Max Adler. He's been busy since his Switch to Birthdays, and he'll tell you all about it. Now let's get to the guy who's graduated high school three times. That's me! Oh my gosh! Your new best friend. Mm Mm-hmm. Brett Davers. Listen up, everybody. Wake up, Grandma. <laughs> this is our show. <sighs> Thank you for joining us la, 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 live on Adobe Radio, YouTube, or wherever you get your podcasts. You can call the show anytime. 1-888-99-IDOBI. Shout out a friend. Shout at us or with us. It's all good. Once again, the phone number is 1-888-994-3624. You can email the show anytime, bdsfans at idobe.com. Maybe you need some relationship advice. Maybe you just need some words of encouragement. Once again, the phone number is bdsfans. That's not the phone number. That's the email (laughs) at idobe.com. All right. Lots of show to get to today. Max Adler coming in here in our never-ending quest to have the entire <laughs> cast of Switch to Birth on this podcast. We're gonna get them all. <laughs> we all we gotta be we gotta be getting close to the end by now. You don't even know we were on for five seasons. Yeah, 104 episodes. You can watch the show on Netflix right now if you're listening. Welcome to the <laughs> Switch to Birth reunion hour. <laughs> My name is Brett, and I'll be taking you through everyone who's ever been on that show. Hey, listen, if you would give me some of the awkward cast members' phone numbers, I could make that happen. First of all, stop saying listen. That's my catchphrase on this show. <laughs> I know. It's getting bad. I listen back to us, and I'm like, stop saying listen. <laughs> listen. <laughs> all right. <laughs> What's up, Boy Wonder? Not much. And Katie LeClaire. It's World Kindness Day, Brett. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, Go do a random act of kindness. Go do a random what? Act of kindness. That is not what I thought you said. Okay. What did you think I said? You want me to go do a random act of kindness? Yeah, you should. I do that every day. I hold the door open all the time, Katie. Yeah. Whether you're a male or a female, I hold the door open. That's nice. Very 2017 of me. (laughs) Equal opportunity. For the door holding. That's right. That way, nobody can ever get mad at me. Yeah. You know? I've heard that some ladies are getting mad now out there if men hold the door open. What? That's just what I hear. This is what I've been told. Seriously? And I say, don't yell at me, because I hold it open for dudes, too. Oh, boy. That's a lot. Mm, It's a lot. National Kindness Day. World Kindness Day. The whole world alike. Wow. We can be united in our kindness. So they all got together and decided. Yep. Mm. That, that's Yeah, that's the, the caveat to your conspiracy theory. This what if the, it's the whole world, not just the nation? This is the one thing the world agrees on. Yeah. Today, on Monday, everyone should be kind to each other. I think they've taken my advice. Yeah. That's nice. <laughs> 
What's the most random kind thing you could do? You said random act of kindness. What's um, the most random? I have a couple things that I like to do. I like to take balloons and write uh, happy notes on on like greeting cards that say like, have a nice day from a friendly stranger. And then I put it in, on people's cars under their windshield wiper. Or What? Yeah. Randomly? Randomly. That's... But they should be like not the nicest cars. Because if somebody's driving a Range Rover, they're having a good day already, right? Listen. <laughs> That's stupid. <laughs> Rude! This is You Don't Know Me by the Butthole Surfers. Thank you for watching on YouTube or for listening to the podcast version of our show. We love you. If you were listening live on Adobe Radio, you'd be hearing real music right now instead of this message. Sometimes rules don't allow us to play that kind of stuff on YouTube or on the podcast. Just putting it out there. Back with more show in a few seconds. Butthole surfers. One of the greatest band names of all time. Yeah, you think so? <laughs> yeah, I love it. Hey, we're surfers, and we're buttholes. <laughs> Writes itself, Katie. You know what sucks, Katie? What? Listen. Oh, you're late. I know. I'm trying, man. <sighs> Let's try it again. You know what sucks, Katie? What? Listen. <laughs> Almond milk. I am not a fan. It sucks. Yeah. I'm having coffee this morning. I'm drinking out of my cup. Go to YouTube. See the cup. I'm just telling people to go to YouTube for the most random things now. I'm drinking coffee, and there's no half and half in the fridge out there. Why would that be? There's no whole milk. There's no skim milk. Oh, there's did no somebody milk forget of, to put it on the list? There's no milk of any kind from a bovine creature. Mm. But apparently there's milk from little tiny nuts. Ridiculous. Here's the thing. Couple reasons why almond milk sucks. Mm -hmm. One, tastes like crap. That's number one. Number two. Oh. What, we got a phone call? Yeah. Who is it from? It better not be from Vicky LeClaire. No. Hi, Mom. Oh, no. No, no, no. Don't Hi, do this to me. It's Monday. Monday. Don't do this to me, Katie. <laughs> Don't do this to Max me. Max says hi. Don't do this oh, to me. You know what? Because it is. The kindness That's day. It. I want to make sure Katie gives Max a big giant hug for us. Oh we love my you, God. Max. <laughs> That's it. I'm leaving. I'm leaving the studio. That's it. Just send Max you in. Know, my mom know, will talk to Max. You know, yeah, you, you need to stop with the switch to birth stuff. It's like picking on the Spurs. That's what I try to tell stuff. your daughter. Stop no, having those no. people in here. See, Vicky agrees no, with no, me. Not, she said you need to stop with no, the switch no, to birth no, stuff. No, I do not. I'm, no, I do not agree with you one bit. I'm saying you need to stop being rude to our wonderful family that we left behind a few years ago. Yeah, years ago. That's the point, Vicky. No, but the they've show all gone was years ago. Things. It's over. Let's no, no, move no, no, on. No, 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 no. They they are wonderful people. I mean, how can you not love Jill and Max? And come on, they're they're beautiful souls. Are and you, it's you know, are you talking souls. about? And you, I do want to. Uh, wait, 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 just a second, Vicky. Slow down over there. <laughs> Are you talking about no, I... Gilles Marini? Yes, I am. The gorgeous, <laughs> symmetrically faced, yes. square jawed Gilles Marini. That's the one I'm talking about. Listen, yeah, yeah, Max. That he is, he is, he is one beautiful person. In and I think out. she just called He's me Max. Fantastic. Gilles Marini is allowed to come in here anytime he wants because he looked at me in a way that I can still feel <laughs> like deep down in my soul. But Max is not welcome. He anytime? looked through me. Well, Max but, hasn't but sat in here yet. My and Max there. Oh. Well, no, Max is allowed so far. I mean, he hasn't sat in the chair yet. Right. You know what I mean? But how about, Gilles. How about my friend Karan? Gilles. I bet he didn't look at you. Gilles yeah. looked at me in a way that I'm still quivering. Yeah. Oh, I understand. Believe me. <laughs> Gives me the shudders in a good way. Oh boy. But listen. It's also, us. I wanted. To, I wanted. Very to good looking listen. man. We, oh god. Yeah. You know, I've I've learned how to interrupt after listening to this show, and I want to tell you that over the weekend, 
I watch this show called Love and Mercy. Oh! I just don't know if your friends know about it, but I want everybody to, to watch it. It's, it's worth the watch. You did a great job, really. I mean, I hate to compliment you on the air, but it was fantastic. We thoroughly enjoyed it. Vicki nice, LeClaire nice calling nice in not just to plug Firewalk <laughs> off the I-10 in San Antonio, <laughs> but calling in to plug one of my movies, Love and Mercy. I love you for it was, that, Vicky. Thank you. Thank you. You did a fine job, but oh, I, I don't want to hold you up. I know it's Monday and you have Max, and yeah. he doesn't want to visit with Sweet Max. But it was a great show, and uh, be kind to everybody. All right, I'll take my own <laughs> advice. Bye, mom. All love right. you. Bye, Katie's mom. Love you too. Bye, bye. All right, now back to what I wanted to talk about. Let's play some music. Really? I don't get to talk about what I want to talk about. What do you want to talk about? It's your show. I'm sorry. I got I got topics here. I got things written down. Vicky go ahead. calls in and interrupts go, the whole go thing. Go ahead. Go ahead. I'm just the producer. I'm done. I'm not, I'm not going to talk about it. Forget it. It's over. The moment's over. <laughs> really ruining my kindness day. Making it hard for me, Katie. To be kind? Making it hard. I love it. Your mom, your mom cracks me up. All right. Uh, now nah, we'll just move on. I was going to – okay, here's, here's the thing. Complaint. Okay. All right. Do it. Quick rant, and then we're going to music. Yep. Almond milk sucks. I don't even know how you milk an almond. It's ridiculous. It doesn't taste good. The poll date on it goes for another six months. That's how you, another reason you know it's not very good. Who knows what's in that crap? It lasts for eight months. Yeah. And also, I'm complaining because Fish, who's been on this show, is supposed to do the grocery shopping around here. I wrote him a grocery list well over a week ago, and there's no groceries in the refrigerator. I'm having a diva freak out. <laughs> I want my GD half and half, Fish! <laughs> is it so hard? Shouldn't be. Ridiculous. That's it. I'm going to Tom. I'm going to the big boss. I want a credit card. I want a company credit card, Katie, and I want it now because I'm going to 7-Eleven. I'm buying my own GD half and half. I'm saying GD because I, I feel like your mom's probably listening somewhere. She is. I bet she's probably listening at Firewalk, home of delicious, delicious Asian lunches at affordable prices. <laughs> we'll be right back. This is uh, Seattle, an acoustic version by the classic crime. Thank you for watching on YouTube or listening to the podcast version of The Brett Davern Show. If you were listening live on Adobe Radio, you'd be hearing real music right now instead of this message and whatever song this is. Sometimes the rules just won't let us play real music on YouTube or the podcast. It's not a big deal. Just putting it out there. Back with more show in a second. Here's the thing, Katie. Yes. If Vicky can call in and interrupt my business all the time, I'm going to interrupt her business on my business show. On okay. my show. Yeah. Is what I meant. What are you going to do? Listen. Late again. <laughs> it's new. If you go into Firewalk off the I-10 in uh, San Antonio, Texas. I-10 in Hebner Oaks. That's right. In the right. Hebner Oaks shopping center. They got a website? Uh, firewalk.com. That's right. Go find out everything Firewalk. But if you walk in there and you say you're in there because of the Brett Davern show, they'll give you free egg rolls. That's Ooh. right. You heard it here. <laughs> Your dad's going to call in next and be so mad at me. <laughs> but it's true, Katie. They'll give you free egg rolls. Free egg rolls now, for any Brett Davern show right. listener. That's what Denny told me. Oh, no. <laughs> Now poor Denny's in trouble. Oh, God. Let's play a song before the whole family just comes in here with pitchforks. Uh, Max uh, recommended this song to us. We're playing this for him. This is California by Phantom Planet. Thank you for watching on YouTube or for listening to the podcast version of our show. We love you. If you were listening live on Adobe Radio, you'd be hearing real music right now instead of this message. Sometimes rules don't allow us to play that kind of stuff on YouTube or on the podcast. Just putting it out there. Back with more show in a few seconds.
It's the best thing Katie's seen so far today. ABC Australia has a report about Sydney Harbour's newest boat. The name was voted on, by popular vote, over 15,000 times. The name? Fairy McFairy Face. <laughs> Other countries have joined in on the fun. Sydney's Warwick Farm's newest racehorse is named Horsey McHorsey Face. <laughs> and I can't even get through it. And Sweden. <laughs> Sweden just announced. <laughs> Are you getting all this? Yeah. Right. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> the best thing she's heard all year. <laughs> Don't worry, we'll wait. <laughs> it's really funny. <laughs> it better be. Katie McKinney face over here. I'm <laughs> turning red. Sweden just announced their newest express train is called Trainee McTrainee face. <laughs> and that's the best thing Katie's seen so far today. <laughs> All right. Trainee McTrainee face. Good Lord. <laughs> you know, other oh. countries are having so much fun out there, Katie. I know. Everyone's having a it's good the time. Greatest. Oh, boy. Oh. Max Adler in studio. Yes. Hello, everybody. Thanks Thank you for, for the coming applause. in, man. Hey, thanks for having me. I'm excited yeah. to finally be here. I know. I'm right? pumped about it. Finally. Finally. Let's put the dig in already yeah. to you, Katie. I'm glad I'm here. You know, no, Katie does the asked. booking around here, not me. Don't I, yell at me. Oh, no. I, I've been yelling at her for three weeks, and now I'm here. So Rest assured, fulfilled. if you're out there listening and you even had one line on Switched at Birth, you'll yeah. get in here eventually. Yeah. There's like a sign-in sheet. Um, That's yeah. right. <laughs> Outside. Yeah. Totally. Yeah. It's a real cast party in here. <laughs> you no. could have one here, actually. Yeah. Why you not? Could. Let's yeah. do it. We should just get everybody just in here. Just bring them Big in old reunion. One. Yeah. Let's I agree. do it. Big live show. We Raise had... some funds for uh, more egg rolls for Firewalk. Yes. That's right. They're They're they better sell out. Or not sell out, but <laughs> big old giveaway going on today at Firewalk. Oh, Max. Rep, rep, rep. What do we want to talk about? What should we talk about? Whatever. We'll get into Switch to Birth later, but what should we talk about right off the bat? You brought in a topic, sort of. Oh, yeah. You brought it up out there. Yeah. LaCroix. Hate it. Do people know what that is out there? People know what that is, right? Yeah. So no one, I don't have to explain it. It's gone pretty viral. It's like it's a national. It's like a stupid seltzer water is that what it, it is it, it's yeah it's like a carbonated flavored water that i i don't get it though there's so many better carbonated flavored waters or For carbonated sure. flavors or things that are better than Lacroix. i couldn't agree more i know it's completely overrated and looking at it you're like it should be pronounced Lacroix, which it is but then you're like oh everyone starts saying la croix and i had to look it up and i realized it rhymes with enjoy that's their that's the company it says so it is La-Croix La-Croix. Rhymes with enjoy. it is la croix i think it's la croix i don't say <clears throat> For foie gras, it's not foie's gras. It's also not Le Clerc. French it's people not. can't spell. So, but why is it Lacroix? Croix? Le Croix. Well, I don't know. A croissant, you know. It's not Quoi. a croissant. You don't say croissant. I don't, but I don't. Want to say, right, I, sh- I should. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I love here's the thing. La Croix is fine. <laughs> it's it tastes okay, yeah. but it's just here's what I don't like about it. Okay. I don't like that. Uh, now I'm I, well, I, first of all I'm off the carbonation. Mm, it's been well documented on this show. I'm off the carbonation. I've been off the carbonation for a whole year. A year? What What caused that? What was the impetus? I like to torture myself, Max. Mm. <laughs> I like to make stupid, arbitrary rules for myself mm. to just see if I can do it. Mm. So last you, New Year's Eve, okay. at like, I don't know, sometime before midnight, I had a, I had a Coca-Cola. Mm-hmm. And I haven't had anything carbonated since. You're a wild man. I right? know, I know. <laughs> no. And I'm almost, but I'm almost there. You're for New Year's Eve? But I'm almost there. Uh, do you feel a difference? Well, I had more than Energy? Coca-Cola. <laughs> but I'm saying that I was like, There's announced. I made an announcement. This is the last soda wow. I will have for a whole year. And you did it. You, you, you Well, the so far, I mean, I'm still going. Uh, it's almost Thanksgiving. Weeks. Yeah. Almost there, baby. Wow. But here's the thing. So everyone's p- p- stupid parties that I go to now at their houses. Has Coca-Cola. Well, they have... They're, no, they don't have any soda anymore at all. All it is is LaCroix everywhere. Oh, uh, I know. Well, that's the Not worst. that I can have any anyway, but it's still just uh. like... 
if I was on the on the coke, if I was still doing coke, <laughs> right. I want coke, not Lacroix. Right, I agree. I agree. This I is Hollywood, baby. Let's do some coke. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Max. <laughs> Brett. I have to complain to you about something. Okay, go ahead. Now, this might get a little personal because it's kind of about you. Uh, you have to you complain to me about me? Yeah, but you don't know it's okay. coming. Bring it on. I'm putting you on the spot a little bit. I'm on the spot. It's a little late coming to the studio this morning. Me? And it's your fault. No, I was. Oh. Katie and I carpool because we live four minutes away from each other. I saw we Katie's We were late car. getting in here Yeah. because she's speeding down the freeway. Oh, Zooming down the yeah. 101. Yeah, I think I know All of a sudden, she takes an exit early. Right. I'm like, where are you going, Katie? Right. It's 3.32 in the morning. <laughs> or whatever ungodly time you we get up. Real early, yeah. She pulls off the freeway, takes another right, and the next thing I know, we're at a Starbucks. Yeah. And I'm like, what are we doing at a Starbucks? We never stop at Starbucks. There's a coffee machine out in the lobby. Fish forgot to buy half and half. And I'm like, <laughs> what the hell is going on around here? <laughs> oh, I think you just broke a corner. Don't worry about All it. All right. So she, we pull it into Starbucks. She says, I got to go to Starbucks for Max. Yeah. Well, I said, listen, we're 20. There it was. Listen, we're 26 episodes into <laughs> this show. Right. Nobody's put in a specialty coffee order yet. Didn't know that. And now we get Tank from Switch to Birth yeah. in here. Yeah. And he's throwing his weight around. Oh, I want specialized coffee. Right. Well, that, this is a two-part answer then for you. I, I One, thank you for this delicious coffee f- of an iced quad espresso from Starbucks. Iced quad espresso. Mm-hmm. Second, I had no idea that I was the first one to get a specialty drink order. Third. I, 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 got, a text, I got a text message saying... Hey, will you do the show? I would love to. My answer. And hey, what can I get you to drink from Starbucks? Oh my gosh, really? You don't have to, but if you insist, you can get this. Wait, and I even what? thought maybe she'd forget because that was three or four days ago, and I was Hold like, you got early morning. Second. I wasn't Hold even going to get it myself. A get second. a monster. Okay. Apparently, I'm yelling at the wrong person. I you mean, are. I don't want to. I don't want to point. This is a Katie. generous offer, but I, didn't, I thought it was just a common thing for the for the Brett Davern show guests. Katie, listen. Well, we do always offer. Oh, but people are like, don't. No, not necessarily. I'm Go not, ahead. Like, wait, sure, wait a I'll second. Listen. What? Yeah. I've said it twice now. There you go. That's oh, for one for good measure. Just <laughs> one. Just put one on reserve. <laughs> do you, yes. Do you text all our guests and ask them if they would like something from Starbucks? If they are personal friends. But then... nobody has taken you up on it yet. Uh, n- no. I'm that guy. No. Oh. It's delicious. All right. Well, I'm not. I'm no longer upset at Max. I, I told know. you this I morning I offered. Thing. I offered. You should be yelling next at me. Time, Don't yell at the guests, Next Brett. time we hang out, I will get you a coffee or half and half. Or a new whiteboard. <laughs> or a whiteboard. <laughs> Since or I destroyed milk. my whiteboard. Or all of it. Well, I appreciate it. I don't know. I saw the Keurig and I was shocked myself. But I, It's all for Max. That's what I'm saying. Well, I appreciate really Max being here and I appreciate his friendship. Max and is a gentleman and a scholar. Coffee. I enjoy him a lot. Maybe it's my fault because I was so shocked to be asked to come on that I was like, am I cool enough? Have I reached the cool enough status to be invited is on? That, as is a that guest? right? I didn't think I was cool enough. You were and waiting. So she was like, not only are you cool enough, but like you get a treat. You were counting down the day. I have been, and this is this is it. This I'm, is the day. <laughs> Today's the day. This I'm is the overjoyed. pinnacle right now. I got my Starbucks. I got my pals. I got a microphone. Honestly, <laughs> what Max, else do I want? In life? We knew <laughs> we knew when we started this show that we wanted you in. I know that. You told me that. I know. It's just that we, ne- we needed to wait for someone else to drop out. Right. I know. I know. I tried to find out who it was. And she wouldn't tell me. Nobody. Know, so, no, someone dropped out. No, here. that's here. not true. I got a Starbucks out of it, so it's okay. Nice. I made up for it. I made up for it. Do we need to work on your self-esteem no, right no, here, here right I'm, now? I feel, feel great. I got my Nobody my drink. dropped out. Okay, let's talk about the drink order. All right. All right. Oh, I thought you were going to say, okay, listen, you always... Pre- What's this beeping? Listen. What's this dinging I'm hearing? He says listen about 700 times a show. Oh, do you actually tally it up and count? Like, this should be like a thing, like, if he gets over a certain amount, like, a number, he has to kind of get something for you. Or, or he should, like, Croy. donate it to someone. Yeah. Yeah, Fire donate. Walk. Let's yeah. talk about the coffee order. Okay. <clears throat> so we walk into the Starbucks. You walked in, there's drive through Starbucks right down the road. Yeah, yeah but there was, like, busy, a million though. lines oh, there in is. the drive through It's, like, in and out. Yeah. You know what I mean? I know. I know. So we go in. Yeah. Thanks. And I didn't know you got out of car for me. That's sweet. No. Listen. I'll walk through fire for you, Max. Firewalk? A firewalk? <laughs> through firewalk? Ding, 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 ding. Uh, ding, 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 ding. <laughs> Listen. Oh, okay, with that. She's having too much fun with the sound effect. <laughs> so we walk in. I said, all right, fine. I like Max. He's a good dude. We've hung out several times. We'll get him a coffee. Yep. 
And then she says, well, no, he doesn't want just a coffee. Right. He's got to have, a, what is it? A, I mean, a quad yeah, shot. I, I apologize before I put the offer in. What's though. happening here? What, said, what is this order? You, actually, can I be truthful? Four shots of espresso is cheaper than any other coffee you can get at Starbucks. Really? Right? What was, was it about two fifty, three bucks? I don't know. You can pay me later. But what? Well, I don't. I, I well, you're gonna four hold shots on, You're gonna offer? Yeah, and you're I gonna make the pay guests it? pay it back? Yeah, it's crazy. Jeez. I'm gonna chip in for some rent in the studio. You know what, Max? It's no, but, on me. Don't okay, worry thanks, about Brett. it. You're a true friend. It takes a real big no, person is... <laughs> over here to buy you a quad shot. This is more potent and cheaper than any drink you can get. Now, here's the thing I've always wondered about Starbucks. Now, I have been able to avoid being a barista so far. Mm-hmm. I have but not. But if this whole radio thing doesn't work mm-hmm. out, <laughs> here I come, baby. Mm-hmm. It's the green apron for me. Mm-hmm. Here's, here's a question for you. Mm-hmm. So you know how, like, drinks, okay, so, like, that's a quad shot, and then quad uh, milk, right. and yep. it's ice, ice. That's right? It. That's it. It's technically I'm a latte. hold it up for everybody. Have a sip if you want. It's as long a venti. As you're not sick. <coughs> oh, so Max is a germaphobe. Yeah. It's basically an iced latte, though, with extra shots. Yes. Yeah, but you get around the extra shot surcharge. This is what I'm asking. Right. So Starbucks, right. does the pricing change depending on the verbiage you use to order the drink? Yes. That's so crazy. Not only that, but get how crazy this is. What's up? Yeah. <laughs> If you ask them to put their own milk into your drink, there's a charge. But if, the, if you just get four shots and ice, and I go pour in my own milk from the little counter with all the sugars and straws, yeah, cheaper. Now they stopped putting all the different kinds of milk on the bar over there. Well, they don't have like your a, almond. Like a couple years ago, but they have your half and half. They have they whole. just half and half now though. Oh really? Over they on have the whole bar. Milk and I think I've seen that. No, 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 no. Not every one of them. No, no, yeah. everybody. The one that over here has a uh, company has policies. Everything. Company policy changed. Everybody. Was there a press ago. release? How do you know no, this? No, this is because they, I'm, to avoid me. They're, they're, I'm this from guy's Seattle, Katie. I know everything about <laughs> Starbucks. Hey, I was, just, I was up in Spokane and I loved Washington. Yeah, it's great place. Yeah, yeah, great place to be from. Yeah, it is. It's really cool. We didn't cover anything about Swiss to birth. That's how you like it. Mm. <laughs> no, well, it's not. there's really nothing else to watch. But I know people still hit me up saying they're binging. They just start it now. Oh, they're watching yeah. it on Netflix. on Netflix. They're enjoying man. it, changing lives, yeah. bringing families together. Yeah. It's oh, honestly, yeah. honestly, it's a great show. I actually really enjoyed it a lot. And I'm just giving you crap. Like, I love having. No, nah, it is a great show. And when I, before I joined, I, I watched and caught up. And I was like, I thought this What girl season was did you come impressive. on there? What's season three? Okay, I'm not there yet. I'm <laughs> Are you up. going to get there? I'm binging, baby. I'm binging. <laughs> As you should. That's what That's the kids the do these binge. days. It? <laughs> if you sure. know me, Max, I love to do anything the kids are doing these days. Right on trend. Like Moana. <laughs> Moana. Oh, my God. <laughs> he just walks around the house going, shining. Yeah. I do the same shining. for, you're welcome. Yeah, you're welcome. Yeah. Yeah. That's I get out of the one. shower, I have a towel, and I go to my wife, and yeah. you're welcome. And she's like, you're not the rock. Get the hell out of here. <laughs> oh, I'm going to stick it to myself in my bathroom for a while. <laughs> Dreaming oh, of the rock. I All right, we're going to take a break and then come back and wrap it up with Max. This is Say It Ain't So by Weezer. Thank you for watching on YouTube or listening to the podcast version of The Brett Davern Show. If you were listening live on Adobe Radio, you'd be hearing real music right now instead of this message and whatever song this is. Sometimes the rules just won't let us play real music on YouTube or the podcast. It's not a big deal. Just putting it out there. Back with more show in a second. Just search for it on your favorite podcast app, but especially the Adobe app for iOS. Oh, yeah, Bitcoin, baby. Mm-hmm. Bitcoin, mm-hmm. speaking my language. Yeah, that's yeah. fascinating stuff. Yeah, it I, is. I, yeah. It really is. I figure out how to get, get in on that. I was at a party, a super swanky Hollywood party a um, couple of weeks ago awesome. down at the uh, Microsoft <laughs> Lounge. Of Coke. Oh, wow, real swanks. Picked up myself up a brand new Xbox One X. Oh, wow. Shout out to Microsoft. Thank Absolutely. you very much for that. Yeah. And thank you for now destroying my life because I will <laughs> never do anything but play video games. Um, but anyway, I was standing there. And I was got talking about Bitcoin with this uh, dude. I didn't know he was th- this fancy, but apparently he is. And he goes, oh, I'm in Bitcoin. I said, oh, yeah, really? How much? He goes, a lot. Mm. He's like one of those Hollywood guys, oh, like, gosh. a lot. Yeah. And I go, come on, how much? I thought he was going to say, like, you know, a grand, five grand, something like that. And he's like, trust me, it's a lot. 
she still wouldn't tell me. Mm-hmm. I was like, so oh, cool. man, this guy's in for it. Like, now I'm interested. Right, of course. Mystery. I'm like, come on, man. How much? And he goes, eh, millions. And I was like, what? And he's like, yeah, I, just, I have it set to buy me the maximum every day. Every day? Yeah. He, he just keeps buying things? It just his, He has an app on his phone that just automatically buys 15 Gs in Bitcoin every day. So, you got an Xbox. Tell me about it, bro. <laughs> I was like, yo, son, I didn't pay for this Xbox, buddy. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I could anyway, sell this for millions. It's crazy. This town's so crazy that you can just be standing next to Because he he's a normal-looking dude, you know? T-shirt, jeans. Oh, nothing, that's how you know they're special. Yeah, exactly. The well, understated rich man. Exactly. But the like, understated, really awesome shoes, They great look like watch. Mark Cuban yeah. standing there, you know? Totally. Who, by the way, you see there's rumors of him running for president in 2020? Is that right? The Democratic ticket? Really? Apparently. But Steve Bannon has his back, so that's kind of a big Mr. Turn-off. Wonderful as vice president? Uh, perhaps. Mm, maybe. Or perhaps. Barbara. I think Barbara would be a good vice president or a good politician. No, yeah. you don't think so? I Shark Tank? Know. I don't know. No? Who she would you have like two a, Shark Tanks Who would you roll world? with? If you went into Shark Tank right now with your next well, trillion cube, dollar idea, you go with the Cubes? Oh, yeah. He knows yeah. what's going on. What if he's, he's out that day? Him. What if Ashton oh, Kutcher's there? Oh, definitely him. Yeah. He's a smart guy with I know money. he is. You have to like, invest in every so many things. You know who I like? I like that guy with the Western shirts that's on there sometimes. The guy from Silicon Valley. He's like, I think he was one of the original guys in Uber. Yeah, I like that guy. Katie What's his name? No. Richard Robert? Nah. I don't I feel know. like there's like eight of them. They're always new. There's you know what his name is? Richie McRichface. <laughs> <laughs> Call That's back. Good. Nice. Um, Max. Brett. All the Swisher Birth people we have in here, I ask them the same question. So mm-hmm. I'm going to ask you. Mm-hmm. Uh oh. Oh, God. I'm embarrassed. I'm going now. to need an embarrassing Katie LeClaire story I know, from know. the set of Switch to Birth. From the set, I don't. I I've been thinking about one. Oh God, here we go I don't again. Know it's if gonna I have be nothing any. but Katie compliments. Here, she I really ask is the everyone best. that comes in here. She we've really had Jill in here. Yeah, we've had uh, uh, Adam Hagenboo in here. Yeah, Adam Adam Hagenboo Boo. I call him. Yeah, Boo Boo. Who else? Who else? Have we had in here. We've had everybody. Vanessa. Here. Vanessa. Vanessa's been in Lucas? here. Lucas. Not yet. No, not yet. He's not on the list, though. Okay, okay. Yeah, you beat Leah? Lucas in here, buddy. Wow. That's and I got right. a Starbucks. That's right. But I, I asked them all, yeah. and they all go like this. Oh, I don't have one. She's the sweetest in the world. She Alec is. Mappa, though, told us about the onset intervention to pull Katie away from the grip of uh, drug addiction, oh? which apparently happened, what, season two? I think I missed that. Yeah, it was season before two. Max's yeah. time. Yeah. Yeah, oh, Max's that, time. you had a whole new take on life when I came in. Come yeah. on, Max. Give me something. I mean, no, there really is. She comes in, she's she's prepared. She's you never saw her open hand slap a PA or anything? No, Man. I've been trying. I've been racking my brain all weekend. Jeez. The only thing, I've, I was bad to her when I'm, I, my germaphobe out. And she is that in, right? She came in sick and had had the, you know, the nose. Do you have a bit tissues. of a germ aversion? I don't know. It's like, a, don't even breathe on me when we're doing the scene. Don't talk to me. Like, mm. oh, yeah, I big germ aversion. You can ask BK Cannon about it. Really? Yeah, yeah I'm not into it. But no, that's it's not Katie. That's, that, that's on me. That's not Katie. You told me to take a sip of your quad shot earlier. If you're not sick. Oh, okay. You have, there's a caveat. You but just trust that I'm or, not or sick? You could, or you could lift the lid. Oh, the know. moment Max thinks that you're sick, like, you're no longer friends Forget with him. Forget it. No, I don't want to be in the car with you. I just, I feel like I see, I see germs floating around. Yeah. Really? Oh yeah. You so always been next to me in an airplane. I cover it up. Yeah. Uh, I just hate being sick. Yeah, yeah, sure. I no, just hate, it gets me down every day. I, I have things to do every day, and I just yeah. I don't want to be down and out. Yeah. But but as far as Katie embarrassing stuff, no, I can't really think of anything. Mm-hmm. We even shot that you know the short film that you helped put up curtains yes, for. Yes. Uh, all night, and she was on her game and super super professional, Whatever. hitting her marks. I literally I can't believe fell it. asleep in the corner though. But then when we Martha's needed you, coverage. you were on and you're screaming and well, then slashing what, knives. What kind of what version of Katie am I getting over here? We got swinging through Starbucks in the morning, making me <laughs> late over here, late on the dings. Yeah. What's oh, happening? Yeah. It's, it's, yeah. You see, if you had four shots of espresso, you'd be hitting those dings That's like a champion. Not. <laughs> All right, yeah, fine. Sorry, I One know. of these days, Katie, someone's going to come in here and tell me that story of you hazing that you poor go... background actor, <laughs> artist. What are we calling him nowadays? Background artist. Background artist. You'll have to go back behind before they switch to birthdays to her schoolmates, probably, and find like some embarrassing stories there. That's true. That's the ticket. That's true. Have some calls? I just want one story of her yelling, I said room temperature! No, there was no it. one. That's the other show I did. Oh. <laughs> That's the other show. This show, everyone was super sweet. Mm, you mean a show where everyone is gleeful? <laughs> that's just, that's the show. Mm. <laughs> that's the show. Mm. Oh man, now my brain's getting stuck. <laughs> I'm rolling through rolling through actors in my head. Oh, yeah. know a lot of people from that show. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I bet lot. you I could tell you the ones. You could say the names. I'll be silent <laughs> on my end. <laughs> just say Nolan's Nolan, and we'll all move on. <laughs>
All right, Max, one last thing to do with you. Christopher? <laughs> Gould? Crystal? One last thing to do with you. Okay. I'm just kidding, Nolan. Wait, did we, I love you. Max has filmed four independent films. Oh, yeah, yeah. Hey, hold on. I don't know when no, they're coming no, out. But you guys are really... I, you listen, always ask me if we're, we're covered everything, and I don't think we five have. five weeks into this... How, what week are we in? We're in six. week six. I'm, don't worry. Okay. We're going right. to get there. All right. Trust well, me thanks. as a Good host, Katie. That's pretty embarrassing. Is that an embarrassing story? Are you pretty... Is Let that me... <laughs> I'm horrified. What is it, Jerry Maguire? Help me help, help you. you. Yeah. Is that what it is? Yeah. Don't worry, Katie. Can't I got it. it. Watch okay. this. I'm a radio professional. Max, I got two cards, one in each hand. Mm-hmm. One's purple, one, or- mm-hmm. one is orange. Hey, my Phoenix Suns colors. Mmm. Phoenix Suns fan? Arizona boy. Oh, interesting. Yeah. Yeah. I once did a short film with Jared Dudley. Uh, you did a short film with Jared Dudley? He's an yeah. actor? Well, as he was playing a basketball player. <laughs> well, there you so, go. Like, like Space Jam. A little on brand, you know what I mean? Uh, Come yeah. on, Jared. Branch out a little bit. <laughs> anyway, uh, I, got, I got two note cards. They mm-hmm. each contain a different line of questioning. Mm-hmm. But you're going to determine which line of questioning I ask you because mm-hmm. I'm going to put them behind my back, mm-hmm. and then you tell me right or left. Well, I already know the color. Oh, have you switched them behind your back? Maybe. I'm going. So I can't even say orange. I have to say right or left. Mm. Left. Come on, orange. Oh, you did switch them. Purple. What a magician. And a host. I know, right? <laughs> That's off brand. You're the only guest who's ever noticed. Some David Blaine stuff. Because this is coffee. Back there. <laughs> it's this espresso. It gets me jacked and focused. Ten questions, Max. <laughs> yeah, go I for it. I couldn't think of a better title for it. Is it Rapid Fire or do I get to think about it? Oh, you can think about it, baby. Okay. We're on the internet. Do your thing. Okay, great. But with that quad shot in you, <laughs> yeah, I'll be we'll going. see how much Rapid. time there is. <laughs> Let's go through both cards. <laughs> <laughs> Number one. Well, I don't think we've ever done that. Oh, well. Number yeah. one. Yeah. What's your most used emoji? Oh, the uh, the winky tongue out. Oh. out. Yeah, the one wink and the tongue. <laughs> that one. Really? I love yeah, that you one... made the face. Hey, Go to one. YouTube and see Max's <laughs> winky tongue face. <laughs> That's the one. Okay, now we come to the question that I we were already talking about. Mm-hmm. Number two, mm-hmm. go-to coffee shop order. Is this the oh. go-to order for Max Adler? Oh, if you were in Tokyo, Japan, no. and you walked into a Starbucks, is this what you order? Depends. It's so many. It depends. What season is it? Like I got a pumpkin spice latte oh, or an eggnog no. latte. If it's an early morning, yeah, why don't I got you put a big on day. your Ugg boots and take a selfie with it, you basic <laughs> bitch. Jeez. I got espresso pumpkin early. Pumpkin spice. Peppermint mocha sometimes. Yeah. I don't know. Oh, peppermint mocha. Oh yeah, it depends God, where I'm you at. You are a white girl, in. aren't you? <laughs> yeah. My goodness. Inside. Can I tell you something? Hot chocolate with bourbon sometimes. Like, oh. walk, walk, like a light festival. They don't throw bourbon in no, there in Starbucks. No, but I do with my flask, you know. Oh, yeah, have a good time. I like yeah. it. Yeah. 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 yeah, daddy's night-night juice. <laughs> Listen, Max. <laughs> yeah. Side tangent real quick. Okay. I went to Japan with some buddies of mine. Oh, my brother little, just got back from Japan. Little dude trip. Experience. Yeah, okay, it great, was great. great. Yeah. The Japanese, they do everything better than we do. I swear. Everything. Yeah. Walk into a Starbucks there. Mm-hmm. They have Starbucks everywhere. Talk about basics. And I, you go to Starbucks in well, Japan? Yes. It was the first... Go to like some, get, get some fugu. Go to like a, go to like no, a sake It was shop. the first day right, there. Okay. And we were like... Okay. Okay. We woke up. We got the time change. It was right down the street from the Airbnb. Understood. Which Airbnb I don't think is allowed there, but whatever. We're breaking the rules. Mm-hmm. Anyway, mm-hmm. we walk into the Starbucks, mm-hmm. order. You go over to the little... At the aforementioned bar with the milk and stuff, right? Mm-hmm. Now... They put a little too much coffee in there. So what do people do in America? They pour it right into the trash can, right? A little off the top, pour it in the trash can. In Japan, they got another little hole on the bar that's got a stainless oh. steel cylinder. Like, like if you're wine tasting, you spit it back you in? Put, you pour a little off the top into there, and it's a liquid thing that collects all the liquid. And it's in every Starbucks there in Japan so that the workers there can just go, you know, they just go empty it. They don't okay. have all the liquid in the okay. trash can. They don't reuse it. No, oh, they, okay. no, no, they don't okay, use it. Okay. But I'm just saying, well, like... It's hot coffee that's been untouched. I mean, why can't we come up with this here? What's up? Why is it taking so long? You know uh, what I mean? A lack of, a lack of care. Miss, Smarter than Mr. we are. Mr. Seattle, why don't you take care of that? Yeah, I don't know. You know, they have bikes know. there that they don't lock up. There's no trash. I know. I know. Amazing. We're doing things wrong. You know what else they do? They have uh, crossing guards at almost every little intersection. But they've also got people pushers, which sounds a bit rude. Oh. Into the subways. They, like, well, that's like, shove you yeah, the with the cow prods. Like, yeah, move it along. Yeah, but rather, then again, I'd dump my coffee in a let's get society can. moving, baby. I kind of <laughs> like it. See? But anyway, they got crossing guards at almost every every intersection to mm-hmm. help you just make sure you get across the street safe. Mm-hmm. And we were talking to someone That's about sweet. it, and they're je- they're all older people, usually men predominantly, but older. 
right? And they were saying that that's the job they give them when they're kind of like too old to work anymore, yeah. but they still give them a job and let them be useful in society. Great. Talk Isn't to that people. Great? Yeah, talk to kids, help them like, out across the It's like street. their version of greeters at Walmart. Hmm. Yeah. All right, back to the question. <laughs> Number three, what's your most watched movie? Oh, boy. Most watched movie? Mm-hmm. What movie do you think you've seen the most amount of times in your life? Oh, my. I ha- my Interstellar. Oh, I might have to go Interstellar. What? I every That's time a it's on TV, movie. it's recent. I mean, yeah, there's your Forrest Gumps, there's your yeah. ETs, yeah. there's the classics. I just love Interstellar, and every time I watch it, I have a new, deep appreciation for love it. It's is the so fifth good. Dimension. Yeah, amen to that. Mm. Amen. Number four, who's your celebrity crush? Ah, mm. uh, you know, I've been binging Game of Thrones recently. I started mm-hmm. way behind everyone. Mm-hmm. I got into that, and mm-hmm. Amelia Clark is mm. uh, is pretty outstanding. Every you, time she's on screen, it's just like... Psh. Which character is it? Daener- Daenerys. <laughs> ah. Yeah. The Stormborn. The Stormborn. Unburnt. Yeah. Mother of Dragons. The Breaker of Chains. Mm-hmm. That's right. How many nicknames well, does this character oh, she's got, like, have? Have you not watched people. Game of Thrones? No, I've watched it, but... Oh, they have to go through... They it's go like, through eight, yeah, every time it's a monologue herself. every time. <laughs> yeah, there's like nine <laughs> she names comes she's in got. the room. And then she does it for herself. Number five, did you ever have an AOL Instant Messenger? And if so, what was your screen name? Yes, Chatterbox17. <laughs> You're kidding. I'm not. And I loved it. And I spent a lot of time on those away messages. <laughs> <laughs> no. That was great. You know, I read some article recently about talking about uh, how, like, that was, like, the birth of, like, the online sexual revolution. Interesting. Because that was the first time people could, act, like, like talk to other people from yeah. different states or different continents yeah. or whatever and, like, not... Yeah. And like be be free and then be anonymous and no one else had ever experienced that before. Right. So we can blame AIM for all the problems going on. Yeah. There blame you AIM. go. Yeah. Blame AIM. Blame AIM. I like to blame Hashtag MTV. blame AIM. Hmm? Yeah, probably that too. How dare both of you? <laughs> <laughs> I like to blame you guys for me still going around saying ABC Family and then everyone goes, it's called Freeform. Free, yeah, yeah. And I go, listen, Freeform doesn't mean anything. We had to do that in the middle of the show. Imagine that. Imagine Crazy. one season you're promoting ABC Family and the next you're promoting Freeform. That being Change said, free form, if you want to give me a job, I'm available. <laughs> Call me. But free form, it literally doesn't mean anything. They yeah. upgraded from uh, family oriented to just anything goes. Yeah. <laughs> but they should have just called it, yeah, I don't know. Anyway, whatever, Freedom. side tangent. Number six, yeah. finish this sentence. Something I need to improve upon is. Boy. Apparently, my coffee ordering skills. No. Your coffee Something ordering skills are on. on point if you were a 13-year-old white girl. The workout routine. I could get in more of a routine. Mm. Now it's just kind of like playing tennis a couple times a week. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I've let it slide, too. <laughs> you're, uh, you're, you gotta, you gotta tennis your is kids. hard. Tennis is phenomenal. It's a great workout. Yeah, I is. love it. And it's a lot of fun. You just need one, one buddy and a racket, and you go out there with some balls, and bam. A couple hours later, you're, you're worked out. Yeah. More fun than hiking. You need a buddy, though. You do. I'll be your buddy. You can play tennis with me. Aw. All right. Let's yeah. go. I'm in. <laughs> Number seven. How many unread emails in your inbox right now? Probably zero. I'm kind of a kind of a freak about it. Wow. Well, There's a lot of people coming in here saying that. It's either 700 or zero. Right, yeah. Right. I yeah. can't do that. No. Yep. Well, I'm on airplane mode out of respect for you guys, but I think it's zero. <sighs> okay. I so it might be it one outside. or two, but. It could be, but very, yeah. very little. I try yeah. to knock it all out. Do you prefer wearing boxers, boxer briefs, tidy whities or going commando? Uh, I prefer commando, but for the sake of society, boxer briefs. Yeah. Commando at home. Right. right. Sure. Why not? Out, boxer briefs. Without looking, you know what color you're wearing today? I think black. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Some Under Armour. <laughs> I think. I, I think. love it. Black or gray? Yeah. Black? All right. Yeah, they're good. Comfort. Number nine. Mm-hmm. And see, here's here's where I do it, Katie. Wait, you ever do the baby powder trick? I feel like that's like an old man trick that yeah. I haven't gotten into yet. The baby powder A lot of old men, trick. you know, they do like baby powder in, in, the, in the box of briefs to like keep everything dry down there. Yeah, of course. I haven't, I you haven't hit do that. You don't do that? No, I you haven't. You don't throw a little talc down there? No. Oh, do come you? on, buddy. You Hell do? yeah, of course. I haven't. That seems like my dad. No. I haven't, well, you're da- I haven't gotten there. Maybe when <laughs> you're a dad. Maybe when, when you're, you're a dad, dad you've progressed you to like throwing the old talc, talc down there. Yeah, yeah, yeah man. That's about. I'm, you got to talc I'm up, my that friend. Day. I'll check it out. Let's I haven't, do it. I haven't manned up yet. <laughs> yeah. You guys can talc and play tennis. A lot of things A lot of things that happen when you become a dad. Yeah, for sure. Talking is one of them. Yeah. Number nine. Here's where I do what Katie was wanting me to do. Ready? What's next? Oh, uh, well, literally today, 
a movie starts filming that I'm executive producing. See, uh, Katie, we came around to it. Called Foster Boy. Uh-huh. Antoine Fuqua is also executive producing. Oh, that's awesome, We've got man. Matthew Modine and Amy Brenneman and Sweet. Julie Benz, and uh, it's a great story about... Matthew Modine. Yeah, how tell about him, that guy? Tell him I love him in Memphis Bell. Random and obscure. Usually mm-hmm. it's Full Metal Jacket or Stranger Things. Eh, that's what I'm saying. That's why you go up okay. and say I'll Memphis say, Bell. Brett Tavern loved you in Memphis Bell. That's right. All right. Anyway. I will. So that starts filming today through the end of December. I got Criminal Minds airing in January. Nice. Did a bunch of indie films that uh, I don't have a release date yet, but they'll all be coming out. All different 60s period piece. About an, I'm an ad agent. Nice. And there's, uh, I play an owner of a porn studio. Ooh. Uh, it's, yeah, a bunch of, bunch of cool things. Wow. Yeah. Look at that. Another, another series I produced that I'm in. I can't Good say where Lord. it's going to go. It's called Gods and Secrets. Of course Superhero he drinks series. quad That's shots. Out. I got a lot going on. My goodness. Pitching reality shows with my wife. See, Katie, movies. if we even got into it with him, we wouldn't even, uh, Yeah, show no, we wouldn't have time. That's over. what's going on. We just That's, have to have him back. There's good stuff going on. That's true. He's, yeah, He's I'll really back. angling hard for that repeat invite. Yeah. Yeah. For oh, have you had a repeat guest yet? No. Dibs. Ooh. Dibs. You oh, you just called it. I Dibs love it. He guest. did my trick. If he says it in the I'll microphone, it has both. to happen. <laughs> I'll bring you both Starbucks. All right. And I'll be a repeat guest. Deal. All right. Deal. All right. And number have ten. Have you had your mom on the show yet? She loves it. Yes, she calls in all the time. Oh, yeah, and true, true. Good point. Yeah. All right, God. Number ten. Yep. The most important question of them all. Okay. Now, seems like a simple question. Mm-hmm. But this question and your answer to this question. Will tell me everything that I need to know about you as a person. Talk about it on the spot. <laughs> tell me about it. Favorite color? No. If you have a favorite color, then you truly are <laughs> a 14-year-old basic bitch. <laughs> All right, here we go. That's bitch with an E, by the way. Right, right. Out there, everybody. All right. Number 10. Mm-hmm. Max Adler. Mm-hmm. What is your favorite fruit? Banana. No hesitation. Come banana. I do bananas and margaritas. I do bananas in my eggs. Banana margarita. Did you hear that? Banana margarita, banana eggs, banana and peanut butter sandwich. Uh, That's a wrap, everybody. (laughs) On another edition of the Brett Davern Show. Thank you out there for listening live on Adobe Radio. You can subscribe to the podcast version of the show on iTunes, YouTube, or wherever you get your podcasts. And if you like what you heard, everybody, just tell a friend. Tell them. That's all we ask. Recommend it. Spread the good word. Say sayonara, producer Katie. Sayonara. Producer Katie's on Twitter and Instagram at Katie Leck Lurk. That's phonetics, people. I'm Brett. I'm on Twitter and Instagram at BDAV, B-D-A-V-V. Someday I'll tell the story. You can follow the show on any social media, including Facebook at Brett Davern Show, or go to brettdavernshow.com for archived episodes, photos, and much, much more. Today's guest, Max Adler. Thank you. Thank you. This is a blast. <laughs> can be found on social media at Mr. Max Adler. Actually, just Twitter. Just Twitter, and there's a couple underscores in there, but. The oh, what? Out. That's not what my producer uh, told uh, me. I think it's at Mr. Underscore Max Underscore Adler, but. Oh, know, my just, goodness. I don't know. Really, Katie? Really? (laughs) I I got nothing. I don't know. There's two embarrassing moments. Just (laughs) egg. Egg rolls all over my face. Banana egg rolls? Ooh, Ooh, now you're talking. Bananas, egg, banana egg rolls with a little caramel sauce on the side. Oh, yeah, Ooh. like that dessert at a Mexican restaurant. I say it wrong, by the way. I yep, meant caramel sauce. sauce on the side. No, what? Carmel. Carmel? What's, what's the city up north? Carmel? Carmel. But it's, it's not spelled caramel. It's not, yeah, yeah exactly. It's, it's, caramel is spe- spelled caramel, but I say it wrong. It's not caramel, it's caramel. What is? The city or the candy? No, the candy. Caramel, not no, it's caramel. caramel. It's caramel. Like caramel. caramel latte. No, it's caramel. caramel. No, it's not. Caramel. Yeah. That sounds like karma or a kernel. Wait, are there underscores or yeah, not? It's, it's, yeah, here it is. There's underscores. <laughs> Give me this. <laughs> Someone else had my, my name. It's at MR underscore MAX underscore ADLER. Phonetics. That's where you can find out about the 100 projects that he has going on right now. Once again, for Boy Wonder, Katie LeClaire, Leclerc. Max Adler, Vicky LeClaire, mm-hmm. Roger LeClaire, Denny LeClaire, dealing with all those crazy egg roll orders today. 
The Firewalk staff. The whole staff at Firewalk. Everybody. Reform. Every cast member from Switch to Birth. Yep. I'm Brett, and I'm reminding all of you to be kind and take care of each other. We'll see you tomorrow. That was our show. Good night. Good night. General Cell. You can watch The Brett Davern Show on YouTube. Yeah, you can. Go to YouTube.com slash Brett Davern Show.